Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Today we are back in Anime Fighters, guys, and today I have another video on how to basically become a rich in Anime Fighters. I've put a list of 10 um, tips to go and become rich in Anime Fighters and just what basically helps me become really OP and get a full team of secrets like this. So guys, this is for everyone in the game. It could be your, like, medium, you could be really good at the game, and you could be, like, maybe just starting off, guys. These help anyone in the game. Also, if you guys are new, make sure to subscribe and also drop a like, guys. Uh, I don't normally do like goals, but guys, can we hit like 150 likes in this video? That'd be pretty crazy. But yeah, guys, let's go ahead and get into the top 10 tips. Starting off as number one, guys. This might be obvious, guys, but playing as much as possible, guys. So basically, just to progress in the game, you need to play as much as possible. The, I mean, the more you play, the better you become, right? It is kind of an obvious tip, but however, it will go ahead and help some people. So guys, if you have any spare time, you don't really know what to do, honestly, just hopping on the game and like playing for an extra hour, that extra hour can actually help out quite a lot, guys. So yeah, just play as much as possible and honestly, it does add up. Tip number two, guys, not everyone can do this and you don't need to do this become, to become really OP in this game. However, it does really help. So guys, in number two, we have buy game passes. Only if possible, guys, obviously you don't have to, to become rich, guys. But however, if you do want to become like mega OP at this game, just go ahead and buy the game passes. Actually, I have literally all the game passes in the game, guys. So yeah, make sure to go ahead and buy the game passes. Again, not everyone can buy the game passes, but yeah, let's, let's just go ahead and move on to number three. So guys, number three is trials. Do as many trials as you can, guys. Trials happen every 30 minutes on the hour and every half past the hour, guys. So as you see, if you go to the first area here and you go left, as you see, there is like this mini K thing. And as you see, I think I just missed it. Yeah, I just missed it, guys. But actually, in 25 minutes, it will go ahead and spawn again. And yeah, this is a great way to get Yen, honestly. Trial, it's so much better than anything. I get around two to three trillion per trial, guys. And that is if I go ahead. And if you guys have got room 48, only if you have it on lots, guys. I'm pretty sure it's in VIP server. Yeah. Actually, if you have time trial skip, you want to go ahead and turn this on, guys. However, you don't have to have it. Uh, but yeah, that does actually speed it up quite a lot. If you guys do have this, make sure to go ahead and use it. And if you guys are new to the trial and you're not very good and you need to go ahead and like get past the trial quite easily getting friends or just getting people from the discord server guys i know a lot of people from the discord server do like to carry people guys so if you just go to the game page and you go to and join their discord server guys there's like a bunch of people in there and stuff that want to like help you in trials and carry you guys but yeah again if you have any friends they can also do that as well moving on guys as you see right here we have tip number five which is using all the codes guys the codes actually do help out quite a lot you can get like an hour of boost like per update but yeah, guys, using all the codes is really OP. Moving on to step number six, guys. We have AFK when you're not playing, guys. So say if you've, like, gone somewhere, like, I'm not sure, like, say if you've gone, like, out. If you guys can, uh, like, tiny task, whatever. If you guys can AFK, like, AFK grind the boss, like, to get yen. Or you can AFK grind secrets or just eggs in general. That's really helpful, guys, because then you're playing, like, all the time. And then you can come back and you might, like, surprise yourself with, like, a, a mythical or something. Or you might get a bunch of yen to go and open the egg, guys. So, yeah, that does help out quite a lot. If you guys don't know how to AFK, guys, I will have the video linked down how to AFK in the description, guys. Make sure to go and check that out. That is how to AFK, guys. Uh, that's how to AFK grind the boss, guys. It does work on every single boss in the game. So, yeah, guys, make sure to go and check that out. So, guys, I'm not sure a lot of people would know this, guys. But if you go ahead and, like, there's, in each area, there's a massive boss sheet. In the best area, it has 300 billion, guys. I'll just go ahead and show you an example in the main world as well, guys. If you don't know, if you actually go ahead and kill this with a friend, it actually gives two times GM. So guys, I'm not talking about that boss at the start, guys. If you go to the back of the map, there's normally a boss, as you see, like this. That has a bunch more HP, guys. And actually, fight bosses with your friends for bonus yen, guys. So if we actually go ahead and, like, defeat this with a friend, guys, you actually get two times yen from it, guys. Which is actually really insane. You do get a lot of yen from it. So yeah, guys, that was number seven to grind with friends on the boss, guys. Again, if you have any friends, I don't have any friends. Coming in on number eight, guys. If you get, like, a mythic app. Uh, or your like best rarity guys say if you have like get a mythic and your best rarity was legendary guys even if that mythic is a low level from a lower area guys make sure to prioritize and level up that mythic guys mythics are so much better than legendaries guys now i know they spawn at different levels guys so like say if we get like a legendary from the best world actually we have um mega mate I'm, I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it guys actually at level one it's 61 damage guys so if you go back like to like slayer corpse like a while ago guys actually the mythic is still 20 damage better and yeah so guys if you do get a mythic make sure to prioritize your mythic and level it up over your other fighters or say if you hatch a secret do the same and yeah coming in at number nine guys if you are tired of afking for yen guys and you want to go ahead and afk something else guys i'd afk secrets 
or like mythics or shiny mythics guys at a lower area guys so say if you're like at maybe like virtual castle guys and you get like you have like 100 billion yen to go and spend you could maybe like move down like a few areas maybe like walled sea and just get the secret there guys honestly the secrets at lower areas are really helpful as well guys they're still really op guys so yeah i definitely go ahead and recommend afk for secrets my first secret i got was when i'm pretty sure it was when the ghoul city was the best and i actually got the one from a hero academy and that was the best guy on my team guys even though it was kind of old it still really helped out because the secret is a secret and all secrets are really op guys so yeah i definitely do recommend afk secrets and then guys coming in at the last tip and maybe one of the most helpful tips guys if you do all the quests at every single area actually we've got bomber here or bulma um yeah if you go ahead and do this or bulma not bulma what did i just say yeah guys if you go to them and you go ahead and do the quest guys if you go ahead and do this you actually get a 20 percent yen boost guys actually when you go to the upgrades you do get a yen boost from here guys so you get 10 percent yen and the badge actually gives 10 percent yen as well guys so if you do all the areas together guys you do get a like a 220 percent yen boost yeah guys so if you do do all the quests you do get a 240 percent yen boost as well as a mount to go ahead and get speed up the mount isn't really too much guys honestly i just bought the robux mount because it's cool uh but yeah obviously you guys don't have to go ahead and get the mounts but you get them anyway from completing the quest guys so yeah definitely complete all the quests you can guys they do get harder as you go of course uh but say if you're like at like five areas in the game guys make sure to do like the first two to three quests any quest that doesn't don't really take over two hours guys if a quest takes normally over two hours just leave it and then grind get a little bit stronger and then try to do it again guys but yeah normally a quest should take you like 30 minutes at max but yeah guys that's it for the top 10 tips guys i hope these do help you out they were all like they're gonna be very important guys you can replay the video if you want to go check out the tips guys but i'm gonna quickly go through them again play as much as possible buy game passes which is optional do as many trials as you can get your friends or people in the discord to carry you in trial use all the codes including my code when you're afk or when you're gone make sure to get afk grind with your friends on the big boss go ahead and get that times two yen boost if you get a mythic make sure to go ahead and prioritize that over all the legendaries and stuff in the game and just level that up as much as possible afk in in secrets in a lower area so then you can actually afford to afk them and secrets are just really op so make sure to go into afk for a secret and then last of all do all the quests that you can guys so yeah those are all 10 tips the best 10 tips that will go and help you become a pro in this game i definitely recommend doing all of these as much as you can and there is a new update coming soon guys and let me tell you this update coming soon is really helpful and it's gonna be really helpful to lower players i think because we have like i'm pretty sure they're like boosts they're like mini boosts on our characters guys so if you didn't play pets and max there's gonna be mini boosts on our characters that give like 0.2 times yen 20% xp boost on that character and stuff guys so yeah that's gonna be a really cool update i'm really excited guys i might be late to the update by like a few hours guys only because i'm going out on that day guys but i still will make a video about the update or some sort about the update i might not record the update actually but i'll try my best guys uh, i asked and i couldn't like pre-record it in the testing server or anything i did try to get permission guys for you guys but yeah i wasn't allowed guys so i'm just gonna go ahead and probably be late to the update or just not record it guys but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and end off the video here those were the top 10 tips to become good at anime fighters i hope you guys enjoyed this and found this helpful but yeah guys make sure to go and like and subscribe if you did find this helpful because we just hit 30k and honestly we're almost at 30.4k guys and thank you guys all so much for the support recently it's been pretty crazy guys but yeah can we hit the like goal of 150 and yeah guys i'm gonna end off the video here if you guys did enjoy it, make sure to like and subscribe and yeah i'll see you guys all in the next video peace out guys